un, deux, trois, quatre, cinq, six, sept, huit, neuf. Sept, huit, neuf. Sept, huit, neuf. Hey guys, it's Caitlin, and today I'm going to be showing you my collection of stickers that I have on my laptop. I think it's finally time to show you because it has filled up and it's all colorful and pretty now. So yeah, let's just jump right into it. All right, so I'm going to be showing you in chronological order-ish. So this is the first sticker I've ever gotten. This is a Minnie Mouse monogram sticker, and it has my initials and the mini bow in my favorite color. I got this off of Etsy from the Etsy Southern Sweetheart Girls. I'll put the name like right here. I really do recommend it because it's so well made. It, this has stayed on for such a long time and I just really love the color selection that they had because they actually had my favorite color which is a nice mint green. Next I have the typical GoPro sticker. Anyone who has a GoPro and a laptop has their GoPro sticker on their laptop because that's just the thing to do. The next one I'm going to explain are this one and this one. I actually got these off of the website Redbubble, and if you haven't heard of Redbubble before, it's a place where artists can send in their drawings slash artwork to this website and it gets turned into stickers and mugs and bags and t-shirts and canvas prints and all those kinds of stuff. So it's really cool. You should go check them out if you want to get some really cool, unique stickers. So the first one I have is this one, and this is Oops, hi, and if you know what this reference is, I love you. This actually references one of the ships in the One Direction fandom, which I used to be a part of, but this references to Larry. Don't hate me, but I love Larry. I know there are so many people that don't like them, but apparently these are the words that they first said to each other when they met, but in reality they are actually tattoos that each of them have. Harry has hi and Louis has oops. Another Larry sticker that I have is actually the Rainbow Bondage Bear sticker. The Rainbow Bondage Bears are two little bears that they randomly started putting um, near the stage on like the right hand side I think at the end of the catwalk and I'm not really sure what they symbolize. Everyone believes they symbolize Larry so I'm gonna go with it but here are two example pictures of that. The next two stickers I have are also Disney themed. This one is an up sticker. I just really like it because all of the different colors that are on the balloons and also it just kind of points out the whole adventures out there thing. Next is another Disney sticker and this one actually is symbols from all of the different parks from Epcot Magic Kingdom, Hollywood Studios, and Animal Kingdom. So this just really sums up my whole Disney obsession in one sticker. I also got those two from Redbubble. And these next two I also got from Redbubble. This one is a Chicago sticker and this one is a California Republic sticker. I live in Chicago currently and this is really cute because it says Chicago and it also has the bean or a picture of the bean inside of the letters and this just really shows how much I love the city of Chicago even though I want to leave and that's why I have this sticker which is the California, California Republic sticker because I want to leave to California. California has been my dream destination for a while now. I want to go to school there, I want to live there, I want to work there. I I just love California because it has so many opportunities, so that's why I have this sticker. Next, I have a Joe Lynn sticker, and if you don't know what Joe Lynn is, you are probably not a swimmer. Joe Lynn is actually a company which specializes in training suits for swimmers and surfers. They come in one pieces and they come in bikinis. The swimsuits that they have come in really cute designs that you can't really find anywhere else, so I really do recommend checking them out if you are looking for a new bikini to wear for your Christmas break vacation. The last two stickers I have are two Hamilton reference stickers. I actually also got these off of Etsy from the Punchline Digital. I really recommend her shop and this is why I ordered this sticker and paid for this sticker. And when it came in the mail, I also got this one as a Christmas present. So that goes to show how sweet she is. So I would recommend ordering off of her. So to actually talk about the stickers, this one says Set Wheat Neuf, which is 789 in French. and these lyrics slash numbers show the relationship between Philip and Eliza, which are two of my favorite characters in the play personally. So these lyrics slash numbers come up in the song Take a Break and the Stay Alive reprise. And Take a Break is actually one of my favorite songs because it is one of the first ones I've ever heard from the Hamilton 
album. And the last Hamilton reference and the last sticker that I have on my laptop is just a sparkly rise up, which I really love. This was the one sticker that I got for free. Rise up, if you know Hamilton, is just like a lyric, which is a motif in the musical. So I just think it's really great to have this because it really does sum up the whole play. You probably have noticed, but I have one big open spot here, and you're probably wondering why. I'm leaving that spot open for a college sticker. I am a senior in high school right now, and I am in the process of choosing a college to go to. So once I do choose that college, I will be putting their sticker right there. So if you want to be on my laptop, accept me. So yeah, those are all the stickers that are on my laptop. I hope I inspired you guys to get some stickers on your own and gave you some websites for ideas to find stickers. Um, make sure you remember to check out the two Etsy pages that I mentioned in this video. Make sure you like this video and follow me on my social media. The links will be down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you comment and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! What?